In this video, I will demonstrate how to build a scatter plot. We will look at two variables here, median rent and median income. Median rent is the median rental price for two bedroom apartments in a number of counties in the United States. Median income is the median level of income among the population in each one of those counties. We will go to the insert menu. We will click on this little icon in charts that looks like a scatter plot. We will select the first one there, scatter. And unless you select the right variables, it's not going to give you what you want. Right click on one of those dots, any one of them. Click to select data. We're going to remove everything here. So click remove, remove, and we're left with an empty scatter plot. Let's click add. For a series name, we can write something down here or leave it blank. For series X values, we will select the median rental prices. Or I'm sorry, we will select median incomes. Series Y values, we'll delete what's there. And select the median rental prices. Click OK. There we have it. Click OK. We should put some labels on this scatter plot. Go to the add button. That's is the little plus sign in the upper right corner. Let's click access titles. On the horizontal axis, that's the X axis. If you remember, we had median income. Let's double click on the vertical axis title. And this one was median rental price. Let's click on the text options over here on this median, median rental price. It's generally not a good idea to have text vertically aligned instead of horizontally aligned. So let's change that. We don't want people to tilt their heads to read our graph. We're going to change text direction to horizontal. There you go. If you don't want it to take up as much space, we can have it take more lines. Median rental. Okay. Let's, uh, these median rental prices and median incomes, these are both uh, represented in dollars. Let's double click the numbers. And we're going to format the axis to show this in dollars. Go all the way down to number. And under category, let's select currency. Uh, we don't need it in cents, so we'll change decimal places to zero. And we can just click away. Let's do the same thing over here. Double click, go over to number, category, select currency. Decimal places, select zero. And then click away. We don't need this label that says series one, so we can just select that and then hit delete. Finally, let's add a trend line to show whether this is a on average, positively related pair of variables or negatively related pair of variables. Select the plus sign and then select trend line. And you can see we have an upward sloping trend line describing the closest relationship, a positive relationship between median incomes in counties in the United States and median rental prices for two bedroom apartments. Finally, we could add a chart title describing that. And that concludes this video.